hope you're all okay welcome back to my channel um i'm back with a new video finally um i have been away for, like i just basically had to take a break i needed to take a break from everything um health wise there's just been a few things going on that's still ongoing so a bit up in the air at the minute should i say so i've just been trying to look after myself take a little break and try and switch off which for me is so hard um in case you're wondering what this is it is part of the haul um so today i'm back with a poundland home decor haul um i popped in there with the intention to pick up um one thing um and i came out there with so much more i was actually really impressed um maybe it's because i haven't been in there in a while or because i've not been like shopping or like doing hauls in a while but anyway i was really impressed so i'm gonna do a huge poundland haul for you today as always guys if you do enjoy it i would love for you to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i'm gonna jump straight in also i've got like a really chilled jumper on today really really super chilled um it's from missy empire and i'll link it below for you i think i've got this in a size 10 um which is nice because it's still quite like oversized um where do i begin i think i'm going to start with a little lantern so i picked up this white lantern this one was six pounds um and I think it looks a lot more expensive so I know that white company have had some like this and I can't remember where else it was that I'd seen a white lantern like this but I just thought it was really nice this for me just looked way more expensive so I think I'm going to use this inside um, I've seen some people use them outside but I think I'm going to go for it inside in the lounge potentially um, I don't know I just I just really like that so I can put a candle in the middle of it which I need to buy but yeah I just thought it looked a lot more expensive and for six pounds I was like I'm going to give it a go, see how it looks in the house. I'm going to start putting loads more content on my home account because I've got loads of stuff I want to do with the house. I've decided, like, kind of want to do a bit of a project, almost. Kind of just want to change everything. Um, so definitely follow my home account on Instagram if you want to see more home-related content. Next up, for £2. So by this is by no means, like, bought the way it because of the way it looks this is just purely for ease so i've actually got this spice uh spinning rack to put in my cupboard i know that some people have these on the side in their house but this just doesn't really fit in at all with my kitchen um so for two pounds i just thought you know what it's fine i can put it in the cupboard and access all my spices so if you've been here before you'll see that i like the poundland steps that i put all my tins on oh my god absolute game changer honestly um so then i've seen they've got these so they do spin around and um, I just thought it'd be easy. I don't know why, but I've collated, um, or gathered, should I say, a load of spices. I guess that's what happens when you're an adult. But literally, my cupboard is full of little spice jars. And I'm like, um, I don't know where they all came from. But for £2, can't really go wrong. I am at a point now where I just want my cupboards to look neat. Because thanks to my little steps and now this, I feel like there's improvement. But prior to that, oh my god, my cupboards were a mess just gonna put it out there um, so this is what the box looks like um, and that's obviously how it should go so it's a little storage turntable handy basically okay so let's move on to this little beast behind me so this was ten pounds but it is an outdoor rug so it's not like a rug material it's kind of like that canvasy material almost like the little beach um, the little things that you sit on on a beach you know like you can get like the really small ones um, it's the same material as that so yeah i kind of want to say it's like canvasy um so it is water resistant if i had my way i'd have loved to have got like a gray one they didn't have any um but they just had this black and white one so i thought i'm gonna go for it um there are going to be quite a few garden updates coming in a vlog i've started to film that already so that'll be coming soon and you'll see what i'm doing to the garden because the difference is crazy so i thought i'd give this a go so it is 120 by 150 centimeters i will try and get a photo up or a story up on my home account this week when i open it up but it's very current and very modern and I'm surprised that I've not seen more of these because I have wanted to get my hands on one for so long. I was going to try home bargains, um, but they didn't really have any in my local one. But that I'm going to pop in there again next week because I haven't been in there in far too long. So maybe they'll have some more in. But my garden is quite long. So I was like, I need something to add a bit of detail down one end. So that is hopefully the aim with this one. Okay, um, what do I want to go on to next? Okay, so the next two items that I picked up were £3 each. I couldn't basically decide between these two so of course I got both so these are three scented candles so we've got linen we've got peony peony and patchouli I think so you say it peony peony and patchouli and wild berry 
cute little bamboo style kind of lids and then I've also got a giant linen breeze one because linen is one of my favorite scents ever oh, nice and fresh so yeah I picked up these so three pound for that one three pound for this one also um it's getting to that time of year, dare I say it, where Christmas, I'm starting to think about Christmas and autumn, I'm sorry guys, I love summer, you know I do, but it's kind of edging towards that point of year and I'm thinking, okay, so my little piece of advice or plan, these are really good stocking fillers, so I know that Christmas is ages away, but if you're someone like me that likes to be organised, I would recommend picking up some of these as like a stocking filler. So whether you do a stocking for your mum or your best friend, I don't know. These are kind of handy and I think that they are quite cute. So um, just worth bearing in mind that for £3 you've got a cute little stocking filler there. But I'm going to not talk about that too much because... I don't want to get too carried away. We are only in August today. So sticking with the garden theme, I picked up two more of my solar lights. I am not joking, guys. I have had these since... When did I first buy the first load? I think probably April or May. Hang on, we were in lockdown in April. I think I bought them just before lockdown, the very first lockdown. So last, so 2020. Uh, one pound each solar panel lights. They are still going strong. When I actually went in there a few months ago, because I had to pick up some more, because um, I've like spread them all around my garden, a girl was in there and I said something, I was with my mum, and she was like, oh, have you got them? And I said, yeah, they've lasted me for ages. She literally couldn't believe it and picked up loads. So don't be put off by the fact that only a pound, they last for so long. Um, so I picked up two more. As I mentioned, I've kind of like spread them around my whole garden now. They look so pretty at night. So just a little close up. Okay, next up, I've decided that I want to do a little bathroom update, I think. So my bathroom, as you'll remember if you've been here for a while, was grey, pink and white and bits of like silver, I think. Um, but I've now decided that I think I want to update it and I'm debating going for like bamboo and white. So the reason I say I'm debating, I went into Poundland and saw all these and I was like, okay, I've literally got like a whole new bathroom transformation slash update for under £10 basically so I'm, I bought it all I'm gonna try it out and see what I think so this is the little pedal bin so at the moment my bin is pink pale pink um, but I feel like I've kind of like come out of that phase now I'm kind of a bit like oh, I want to do something different so this one was six pounds it's five litre and it's just got the little bamboo lid so it's white and bamboo I was actually really impressed with that because I feel like well you'll, you'll see the other bits in a minute but I just thought I literally if you're somebody that wants to freshen up your bathroom or whatever, you can literally spend £10 in Poundland and you've kind of got it covered. Um, normally a bin itself is like more than that anyway. Let me just wrap it back up. So this is the bin. But I then also picked up the little bamboo soap dish. So this was a pound, which I thought was nice. I'm so upset, they only had one of these left. Ideally, I would have liked three or four and put them on my little ladder shelf, but I'm gonna go to another pound land and fingers crossed they've got them. These were a pound and they're just little trinket pots. So I would put in here my cotton pads um, or I don't know, anything that you may wanna store in there, little bath bombs, you've got options. So I thought that was quite a cute size. And then I also picked up a soap one, again, a pound. I just feel like I've completely modernized I've got the choice to completely modernise the bathroom there for under £10. So it's definitely worth taking a look in there. And bamboo's kind of everywhere at the minute and I really like that kind of vibe. So these little items I'm going to put in my bathroom and hope for the best. Um, oh, sorry, I had a sneezing fit. If I like it, then I'll upload it, obviously. Um, but I don't see why I won't like it. I feel like it's going to fit in quite well. So for £3, I then picked up a oven dish. I just needed a new one. This one is a cream one nice and sturdy it's that ceramic um creamy uh style so i just got this because i want to start making like a few little bits and bobs that's basically it but i really like the creamy color i also bought my little mini one to put my baked oats in my baked oats that i've still not done and that was about three months ago but i am going to get around to trying it but yeah it matches the same they also do it in gray so if you've got like a gray kitchen theme they've got you covered but i went for cream because i really like it and my plan is to eventually get my kitchen cream I then also picked up, these are the best, so these are 97 calories, so if you want a little snack that's not too naughty, these are the best, Jaffa Cake Bars, 
like I say, 97 calories, and they're my go-to at the minute. I love them. <laughs> Getting through them a bit too quickly for my liking, though. And then for £1.25, such a random price, I just picked up these micro-fresh, like, Tupperware dishes. Um... So, again, I've got so many of these, but I feel like I always lose the lids. I don't know what's going on, but basically a top up. I then also picked up one of these for the bathroom. So these are the Febreze Air Freshener. I got this in Cotton Fresh. But, yeah, I just thought I'd try something new. My candles are kind of like, my candle stash is running low. Like, I know I've just bought those ones, but I'm thinking autumn's coming. I need to get ready for my candle season. So I'm going to go candle shopping soon. But anyway, this is in the meantime. I am so excited about these. So I love these Turkish delights. You know online when you see like all these um, tiered like chocolate bars, like what's the worst here? These are always at the bottom, yet they are my favourite. I love that, well, one of my favourites. I love them. So these are like mini ones. They're 55 calories in each bar. And I'm like, what? So I've not tried them yet, but I saw them and Turkish delights are my like guilty pleasure. I love them. And then last but not least, a real exciting item here. But I don't know what's going on at the minute. I don't know if my hair um, is just molting. But my water in the bath is taking forever to go down. So probably like a month ago, I put um, one of these down there and it worked. But it seems to be slowing down again. So I'm a bit like, mm, what's going on? So I just picked up this sink and drain gel. Unblocks all sinks and drains. So... Fingers crossed that that gets rid of the problem. I'm not going to lie. This is probably one of my favourite Poundland hauls. Um, I Some people go in there and never find anything. But I always seem to find really good things in there. So I'm really happy with the bits that I've picked up. And I feel like it's really reasonable. So this whole like haul, I think, came to uh, like just over £40. But considering like the rug, which has now fallen down, um, was £10 on its own. And like the lantern was 6 The bin was 6 um, it's not bad at all and I've got so many new home bits now so I'm gonna get my organisation on this afternoon. So let me know what you guys think of the bits that I picked up and I will see you in my next video.